Are you looking for a JRPG experience that rivals console and that you can keep in your pocket? Mobius Final Fantasy may be the mobile game for you. Square Enix has been dabbling in the mobile game realm for quite some time now, so let's see if they finally hit their mark. Hmm. <laughs> I sense there is something great in you. You begin the game as Wolf, or whatever you happen to name him. He's what's known as a Blank, people who end up in the land of Palamecia suffering from amnesia. Blinks are nearly identical, with very little distinguishing features from one another. Wall, however, is the one who stands out amongst the crowd, and is destined to be the warrior of light that saves Palamecia from an army of chaos. The story is pretty predictable, but it's nice to have a solid, coherent story in a game like this to make you feel like you're a protagonist with a goal and an identity. The visuals certainly do a good job of keeping you engaged as well. The game visually looks great. I honestly didn't know that mobile games could look this good. The design is very obviously Final Fantasy. It looks almost as if Final Fantasy 14 or 15 models were ported to mobile for this game. Obviously, the game isn't going to look as good as its console cousins, but it doesn't disappoint either. All of the character and creature models are extremely detailed and designed in a way that we would expect from a Final Fantasy game. The animation also runs extremely smoothly. I find myself actually wanting to watch the cutscenes as the smooth natural movements bring the characters to life. This is just as true in battle. There are a couple dropped frames here or there, but for the most part, it can sometimes be just as fun turning your game on auto mode and watching your character tear through some baddies as doing it yourself. Aside from exploring Palamecia in a Super Mario Bros. 3 fashion world map, you'll both be collecting and battling quite a bit. If you're a fan of champion, creature, or card collecting games like Unison League or Brave Frontier, you'll enjoy the collecting aspect of this game. During battle, your character has access to four spells. These spells come in the form of cards that you collect as you defeat monsters or buy them in the shop. As to be expected, you'll also need to fuse cards together to level them up for maximum effectiveness. It's also nice to see some of our favorite Final Fantasy creatures and characters on these cards. It's a welcome nod to nostalgia. Battling is pretty standard turn-based combat. As you do your standard melee or magic attack, you'll begin to accrue element orbs, which you can use to fuel your spells. Elemental weaknesses and resistances are also something to keep in mind. Although, they do work slightly differently from what we're used to. A monster is resistant to spells of its own type, but weak to the spells of the opposite type. For example, a fire-type monster is resistant to fire, but weak to water. And the same thing would go for wind and earth, or dark and light. It also has to be taken into account that certain classes only have access to certain elements, so build your classes and decks wisely. The game sounds like a Final Fantasy game through and through. This is apparent all the way from the fully voiced characters to the battle victory fanfare. Battle sound effects make the combat feel meaty and satisfying, and the battle music does an excellent job of setting the atmosphere. Voice acting isn't amazing, but it's definitely just another thing that makes this game stand out above other mobile games. All in all, Mobius Final Fantasy is a great mobile game, with a coherent story, make you drool a little bit visuals, addictive collecting and combat, and several nods to Final Fantasy fans, there's no reason that you shouldn't give this game a try. Heck, it's free! Go! Go download it! Get it. Thank you guys so much for sticking with me through this review of Mobius Final Fantasy. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. If you guys have any other requests for reviews, please let me know, and I'll have another one for you guys next week. But seriously, go download this game. Go. Go do it.